It's been a long day at school. Stress levels are high, and like many, this particular person goes to find a relief. The person finds relaxation in the form of a video game. An act of pure immersion in the game offers an escape from everyday life. And although this simply looks like controlling a virtual creature as a fun pastime, there are far more complexities happening while playing video games, especially in the human brain. While playing video games, two chemicals are commonly released in the brain, oxytocin and dopamine. Both derive from the same part of the brain, the hypothalamus, which controls both the autonomic nervous system and the activity of the pituitary. Oxytocin, one of the most comical chemicals released, results from a protein deriving from the OXT gene, being broken down with water and catalyzed into a hormone, which is then released through the pituitary gland in the hypothalamus. It's often known as the trust chemical, causing a player to become more attached to a video game, and is generally associated with increased amounts of kindness in individuals. Dopamine, it is produced in the substantia nigra and is derived from a chemical called L-dopa. Dopamine gives the feeling of elation, so people tend to feel happy when playing video games due to this chemical release. The chemical reactions in the brain lead video games to be very pleasant and interactive experiences. Hopefully, we will always be able to turn to video games for adventure, fun, and a virtual house away from home. If you'd like to learn more about the chemical processes while playing a video game, visit www.chemistryislife.com.